Today, computing skills are the most sought after in the United States. Yet women's share of the computing workforce is falling. New research from Accenture and Girls Who Code shows us that if nothing is done to close the gender gap, only one in five computing jobs will be held by women in 10 years' time. In 2015, there were half a million new computing jobs and less than 40,000 new computer science grads. So the gender gap will have severe consequences for the U.S. economy. But this decline can be reversed. We can triple the number of women in computing by 2025. That's 3.9 million, pushing their share of the workforce to 39%. But we must act now. We need to spark the interest of girls in junior high by informing parents and teachers better about the wider importance of computing. We need to sustain their engagement in high school, where girls' initial interest often competes with social factors. In college, we need to inspire young women toward a career in computing through role models, summer immersion programs, and mentoring. It's time to take action, because we need more women in computing. It's time to crack the code, together. Time. <laughs> All right. Is this better? <laughs> How about now? All right. Okay. Which one's working? Is it it's the? Okay. No, I'm good. The lab, labs work. So well, welcome. My name's Dave Treat, and this is an example of what happens when the man facilitates the session. Alisa did beautifully yesterday, and there were no problems. Um, put me in charge and it's all going to get screwed up. So we're, we're going to have a bunch of fun today. Uh, so fantastic panel yesterday. Uh, Alisa, uh, Caitlin, Sharon, uh, um, we've, we had, uh, uh, now I'm blanking on names. Oh my gosh. Uh, yes, Amanda, uh, <laughs> sorry. Um, <laughs> Sharon, Amber, uh, Galia, and uh, Christine, and Hannah, and I don't think I now forgot anybody. Um, but really, was just so impressed yesterday with the dialogue. Um, I was actually more impressed with what happened afterwards. So my name's Dave Treat. I lead blockchain for financial services for Accenture. I'm the deputy head firm wide. Um, coming out of this session yesterday, there was just a massive amount of dot connecting that happened. Um, even in the panel, Amber was describing the work, you know, the, the meetups in New York, uh, Girls for Code, you know, sorry, Girls Who Code was referenced. Uh, there's just a whole bunch of activity that's underway um, that we're all doing individually. And the, the really fun part of what happened afterwards was people saying, hey, we need to join these things together and we should, we should reinforce each other and we should be, be driving this stuff together. And that was a lot of fun and that's actually the purpose of today. So what we're going to do today is use an online collaboration tool called Think Tank, hence the need for everyone to have a log on and, uh, and a facilitator at the tables. And what we want to do is carry forward the excitement um, and the dialogue and the enthusiasm from yesterday where there was all sorts of, you know, all form and flavor of great ideas, motivation, inspiration. We want to now turn that into actual action. Uh, things that we can do together as a community, get volunteers to do it in a very sort of, in a very open and collaborative manner, connect all those dots that we had in dialogue going after yesterday's session. So the way this is going to work is we're going to um, have a bit of a facilitated brainstorm. Uh, this is not going to be a normal presentation. I will say actually very little, uh, which is good. Uh, we're going to uh, pose some questions. We're going to go heads down at your tables and brainstorm together. 
Uh, you will see through this online collaboration tool called Think Tank that we're going to amass a set of input very quickly. We're then just going to lightly massage it uh, and, and move on. And the end goal of this session is that we come up with two or three things that we think will actually make a real difference in progressing our shared objectives that everyone so, was so wildly enthusiastic about of achieving gender equality and diversity, uh, particularly in blockchain, but certainly in the wider technology domain. So with that said, um, let's transition to the tool. Uh, if you, again, just quick show of hands, any table does not have a laptop and a facilitator. Still good, all right. So um, with, within the tool, what you're gonna immediately see uh, at the bottom as you've logged in is now a freeform text field. We're asked the basic question of uh, in literally two minutes, take two minutes at your table and through your facilitator, punch into the, into the freeform text box every related initiative that you know of or are running or uh, are just aware of that is helping to drive uh, gender, gender equality and diversity uh, when, you know, for not, not women in blockchain necessarily, women in technology, gender equality. Take two minutes, throw in as many of the, the existing initiatives underway. So as I said yesterday, we heard you know, Girls Who Code, We Learn, et cetera, meetups in New York. Throw out your ideas to your facilitator and put them into the freeform text box. Steve, can you scroll down? Let's see how many we've got. Thirty seconds. We've got a lot. Okay. Last couple. Are they slowing down, Steve? All right. All right. All right. Let's cut that off. All right. So, what? How many? How many did we get? Can you scroll down? Forty. All right. So, in, you get a sense for this tool, right? One of, the, one of the things and one of the reasons why we like to use this tool is it actually democratizes brainstorming. In a typical brainstorming activity, a single voice dominates the discussion just because you have to talk and so you have to listen and one person can speak. Um, we love this tool because in, 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 in less than two minutes, we had 40 ideas pop into the tool. So now let's, now let's massage them. Um, we're going to now open up a different uh, dimension to this. So of these programs exist, drag and drop, this is wiki style, last action counts. You can uh, drag from the right into the buckets on the left of these programs, work great, work okay, could be better. So again, everyone can act on the list. We're gonna massage this list of, of 40 together. Drag into the categories. You can click into the categories and decide you wanna move them between buckets. And let's see how quickly we can get the 45 categorized into those buckets. Call it out to your table facilitator. You can look up at the screen. All right, take 60 more seconds. Just quickly drag and drop. There's no bit, no, no. Judgments, just quick instincts. Hmm?
All right, 12 left. If you put them on the list, presumably you might have an opinion. So <laughs> if you threw these out on the list, let's just get them bucketed quickly. Yes. 11 left. Six. Almost done. Three, two. Last one. All right, perfect. All right, so let's um, let's let's just quickly review where we are. So let's click into works great. Girls with code. We've got a couple of dupes. We can clean those up. The meetups for women in blockchain. Excellent. All right, so the next thing we want to do, again, we're in kind of, let's just take stock of what things are underway. So just foreshadow where we're going with this. We wanted to get out what, what's, what exists, because the next thing we want to do is brainstorm what, what could be and what, and what new crazy ideas are out there that we, we, should, uh, we should explore. So in the spirit of capturing I, you know, thoughts and ideas around the what exists category, uh, can we go to, well, before we go to new ideas, Steve, let's go to, um, let's go back. Let's just take a moment, just because it may inspire some of the brainstorming of the new ideas. If we click on, uh, could be better. We'll just open up ideas for improvement. So again, at your table, just pick one or two that's on the list that you're familiar with and throw in your ideas either about you know anyone in particular or if you don't if you're not familiar with any of these in particular throw out some of your ideas to your facilitator just around in general what could make these initiatives better let's take 90 seconds to do that so really just pick one or two Take, take another 60 seconds, just capture one or two key ideas at each table. Your last thought. Sorry. I can't hear you. Oh, I see. Uh, it's fine. So yeah. So we're we're uh, we'll improve on the instructions for next. <laughs> All right. Let's uh, let's take a pause here then. So we can we can go heads up from the tool. I think let's just if we review the group quickly. Uh, obviously, some key themes here, right? The inc inclusion, communications, as we, you know, consistent with yesterday, having men in the conversation is a problem we have to solve together. Uh, the, you know, the, I, I like seven. I think that also was consistent with yesterday, right? Of, of we heard we need we need we need outcomes, right? We need to be outcome based, not just talking and not, not just dialogue, but actually uh, getting applied and and driving outcomes. I think uh, scroll down for me a little bit. Steve, can you scroll, scroll to see the bottom of the list? Slight delay. <laughs> so, all right, so while, that, while that's happening, um, it, 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 in terms of the themes that, that emerge at the table, um, we, we, I'd, I'd like to just make this a little bit more interactive um, as, as a group. Anyone had a particular insight, not on the list or in summary? It's not moving? <laughs> All right. Technical difficulties continue. Um, 
All right, let's pivot then. So our goal here was to just get the dialogue going, take stock, what's existing, what's, what could be improved. All then is the, the inspiration and motivation to go into the next segment, which is we're going to take a little bit more time with this, brainstorming at the table, what new ideas, and you know, emphasis on the, on the crazy and creative, because uh, people have been at this for some time. New ideas, I think, taking the, the feedback from the ideas for improvement that are really very outcome oriented, action oriented, uh, and, uh, you know, and, and, and measurable. So are we frozen or can we go to the next? All right. So same style. In the new ideas, go crazy. Just no bad ideas. This is anonymous, entirely anonymous uh, feedback, uh, and, the, and the tool is entirely anonymous. Behave. But let's get um, you know all form of crazy ideas out there as to how we can make this better. We're going to take a little bit more time for this. We'll take four or five minutes. Discuss at your tables, and let's get uh, as many good crazy ideas out there as we can. Can you scroll down to the bottom? Scroll, scroll down to the bottom. All right, quick show of hands. Five more minutes. Stop now. Five more minutes. All right. It's okay. We'll take a lot. It's fine.
right, Steve, how many are you up to? All right. All right, they're starting. The ideas are start starting to slow down. Let's uh, let's bring it back for a second. So, um, are you, we have been able to do any dupe checking, or uh, all right, let's cut it. Let's cut it off for now. So let's let's scroll through this list together for a minute. So Steve, why don't you go go up to the top? All right. So I, I, I've been trying to watch as they've gone through. I think um, I think there was there was you know, quite quite a few around around pay. There were quite a few around sponsorship. You guys want you keep talking? That's <laughs> good. That's no, good. I've lost my facilitator. We are. So it's yeah. So so a great question from the table here in the front. Um, part of this tool is that it, all of this is. Thanks, Steve. Um, part part of part of the use of this tool is that it's all immediately captured. We're going to be able to dump it out at the end of the session and share it with everyone. So. Uh, it's a great question. Uh, we will post it to our site somewhere, so it'll be downloadable. Um, Elisa, where? I lost Elisa. We're gonna post. We will post this to our to Accenture.com forward slash blockchain somewhere to be. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, so it's a good point. For those of you who didn't hear, um, we, the 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 setup of this is is yesterday yesterday's panel discussion. Today's really very action oriented brainstorming and dialogue is is the beginning of a program that we were going to be sponsoring and running on an ongoing basis till it's solved. Uh, and so, as Elisa just said, uh, there's going to you know hanging off of our site, we're going to dedicate a page to this where we'll be able to interact as a community. This data will be available. Uh, the nice thing about the tool is it just dumps out in a, in a decently formatted process. We'll have the raw data, uh, but then we'll also have a means by which we can coordinate and collaborate. All right, so um, as always, so the, you know, a huge mix of ideas. Uh, I, I shudder to, to, to stop the conversation because our goal is to get this dialogue uh, going. So it's a balance between all the great interactions at the table and capturing the tool. But let's just scroll through the list really clearly, because I know quickly, because I know everyone can't see the laptop. So Steve, just kind of slowly, can you can you click through from the? Let's start back at the top, because I wasn't paying attention, <laughs> um, and just slowly just run through it. So um, I'll try to just call out some of the trends as we're reading it. Uh, so starting starting earlier, um, I saw multiple that were around sponsorship. Um, I like that you know if I, a dedicated organization is really interesting. Uh, the early engagements was definitely a trend, you know. So we got both Girl Scouts, you know, parent-child activities, um, coaching and sponsorship. So um, our, our team, the uh, we're trying to do some groupings, which is great. So the one-on-one -on -one coaching, uh, add an LGBT focus to so the the interconnection that you know, just broad diversity uh, grouping together our, our efforts is key. Men take family leave. STEM, ensure 50%. Yes, yeah, so pay equality was it was uh, featured in some of them. Participation, peer teachings is great list. So teaching holacracy. We're uh, yeah, really nice job. Quick pause there. Sorry. Number 30. 30. No dancing. So we do we have dancing girls at this conference? Where was I? Okay. That's horrifying. <laughs> Sorry? I, I, it, it's not funny, no. Yeah, no, I mean, it's horrible. I mean, I'm shocked. So, yeah, so, um, yeah, all right, so let's, let's bring let's bring the attention back. Um, so clearly, so there, there was that. So, so no dancing girls in consensus. And then I saw another one, which is let's let's adhere to the anti-harassment policies at the conference. Um, you know, clearly those are really important conversations for the for those of us in the room that are key sponsors of this event. Um, it's imperative we give that feedback. I'm I'm horrified to see that stuff on the list, and I clearly have been stuck in my own one-on-one -on -one conversations too much. Sorry. 
You have a video of it. All right. So, yeah. So I guess I call to arms of those of us that were sponsors in this room. We need to get behind that feedback, you know, wholeheartedly. Sorry. Yeah. All right. So high-level senior support. Uh, Secure anonymous options for salary disclosures. That's a really interesting one. Shadow role models. More content. Again, uh, horrified. Uh, I'm horrified by the dancer's piece. Um, podcasts. All right. So, fantastic list. Yeah. With what? Harassment. Yeah. Yeah. Does anyone want to volunteer with the besides? I mean, obviously the dancing girls was it could it could have been that would trigger the harassment. Does anyone want to speak? What was the other harassment issue that? Well, I didn't bring this up, but I think like a lot of women that I've spoken to have had really painful experiences about these things are a lot of younger women are looking for mentorship or looking for people to network and talk to. And I think just in general, maybe whoever wrote that I didn't mind personally, but I think myself and other women that we've spoken to experienced situations where we're kind of but then, try to something else. Um, All right. So, so sorry. We, maybe we can get. Can we get a mic just to pass some of the comments? But I, I, if I if I try to if I if I repeat what you, what you just shared, it was it, the comment was that as 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 younger women it, there is I guess experiences where younger women were seeking mentorship at the conferences and the, just the interactions weren't appropriate. Is what it sounds like. Yeah. Yeah. So Dakota here. Let's get. My, Thank you. I'll, I'll say <laughs> one thing I'd add. Sorry. One thing I would add on to that. Can we get that mic turned on, please? Shout. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> um, yeah. One thing I'd add on to that is also that women seeking mentorship and men not offering it because they're worried about some optics or perception of impropriety. And so suddenly men are getting, young men are getting mentorship while the women are seeking mentorship and not able to find it. Anybody else have a comment? Just raise your hand, please. I appreciate the number of panels that have had women on them and women primary speakers. Really appreciate that as feedback. There's still plenty that are totally male, but appreciate all the women that have got up and contributed. It's been great. On, on that point, is Brian in the room? I, the Brian, I, Brian Bellendorf made a comment to me at Cybos last year. He said he refuses to be on a panel anymore if it doesn't if it doesn't have gender, if, you know, it, it doesn't have gender diversity. I, I have huge respect for that. I've tried to apply it myself. So if Brian's not in the room, big call out to Brian. I think it's it's a great stand we should all be taking. And and yeah, it's key. Sorry. Um, I just wanted to give a bit of what a daily experience is like for a woman at this conference. Um, the past 24 hours, I've been called beautiful, hot, gorgeous, adorable, cute, and uh, I've had hands on my knees and on my shoulders. So I, you know, is it quote unquote harassment? Hard to say, but yeah. it's not the professional <laughs> that's experience. Not, uh, like <laughs> that's, that's that's pretty clear. That's harassment. <laughs> Horrifying. Yeah, yeah, Amber. So, did I, was it? How many people were here yesterday for yesterday's Women in Blockchain lunch? So, and I, I made my joke about wearing my little Smash the Patriarchy hammer necklace. Um, a guy walked up to me at the networking hour after the fact, grabbed my necklace on my neck, and said, "Maybe you need to listen to a man's opinion once in a while." <laughs> that is a thing that happened. Uh, no, I, I, a regulator walked by and I was like, I'd love to talk to you. It was great. <laughs> so that was fun. And if anyone's following the, the Twitter feed of the other picture that I posted, it's super great. The guy who said, she's definitely not a thinker. Um, and uh, a variety of other jokes I cannot repeat that are being live streamed on the internet, but feel free. Uh, Amber Balde. E.T. with an E.T. Well, there you go. Yeah. Get involved. <laughs> right here. <laughs> So I, I mean I'm I'm almost inclined to open up. It's, I, you know what? It, it, should we should we, we want to open up a new module? Uh, I mean just is in a different direction. Should we open up a new module and just take a few minutes and talk about are there things you know feedback 
feedback that we should be giving around the experiences at these conferences and you know, let's, let's make it you know, productive, right? So action, actions and suggestions around what could be done to prevent, you know, th these are obviously completely unacceptable behaviors anywhere, but we, again, we as sponsors have a really strong voice to be able to influence you know, how this happens. Yeah, sorry, Alisa, can the microphone over here? So I, uh, hello. I just want to say that uh, Ryan Selkis did resp respond to me on Twitter very quickly and said that was unacceptable. And if anyone could point him out, that he would be excused from the conference. So the, they responded very quickly. Right. Yeah. Sorry, there's com comments over here. I j hi. I just want to thank Accenture for having this dialogue. And I think this type of dialogue needs to happen at more events. It's, uh, and, and yeah, I guess I, I'm just shocked. I am, so let's open up that module. It's a, so, so, so this is, so we, we will, oh, sorry, my computer timed out. Hold on one sec. <laughs> um, all right, so, so I, I just think it's imperative that let's, let's take, let's take another, let's take another few minutes, discuss at the tables, feedback that we want to give to the conference organizers and, and really just more broadly as we're sponsors of multiple conferences throughout the year, we should be giving, you know, we should be setting ground rules and, and guidelines. It just, let's just, cap, let's capture it, right? So in the moment, can we just capture all the feedback that we would want to give to not just this conference, but other conferences that we all attend? Yeah, because I, I think the ultimate goal is to make people that exhibit that kind of behavior uncomfortable, not the women that are, are the subject of it. Steve, can you scroll? Steve, can, can you scroll down as they come in? expand on the better layout aspect we, uh, whichever table put in better layout maybe just like maybe just to add just a little bit more just on what, what was meant by that Keep scrolling down just to So the um, so thank you everyone. Uh, the the ideas have started to slow down slow down in the tool. Obviously, this is the beginning of a dialogue, um, but but we do want to 
we, we, uh, Lisa just point, uh, Lisa just pointed out. Sorry, can I just get everyone's attention? Just let's just bring it back. Um, uh, so what, what, what has naturally emerged here is, is two tracks to this dialogue, right? So I think we need to, so we will consolidate this feedback, but obviously um, it's, 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 you know, it's one-liners, right? So we need, you know, so let's find a way where we can, we'll, so we'll capture this feedback, we'll consolidate it, we'll find a way to present it to the, to the conference organizers, but anyone who wants to engage with us to expand on it and, and either provide more context details or suggestions, we'll do that, we'll figure out a way um, in case a lot of people want to do that, that we can collaborate on that um, easily. Uh, so we'll do. Let's so let's do that. And I can't agree more with. Uh, I mean, some great suggestions, but the net, the the this has to start forming a basis by which behavior is, is just you know is improved in these in the. Sorry, what are you pointing at? Could leave it open. Oh uh, yes. All right. So that's a great. That's a perfect idea. So what so what we'll do. Um, so this tool can be used you know, either as we're doing it right now live in the room or actually we will leave it and asynchronously everyone can go in if you choose to uh, log in. Um, it, will, it will continue to be anonymous. So, you know, so feel, free to, well, feel free to identify yourself or not identify yourself. We'll leave the tool open and maybe we'll, en we'll end and we'll put up the logon credentials that anyone could go in and use and, and add and we'll leave the modules open where you can capture additional feedback Maybe we'll leave it open for, you know, we'll leave, we'll leave it open and see kind of how much more streams in and then we will consolidate this and make sure that it gets to both this conference organizer and then as we plan out our next, you know, we're all going to the next series of conferences. We'll make sure it gets to everyone. Um, so let's, let's pivot. Let's go back to the, because um, I do want to cover the other track too around um, the new ideas. So we ended up, we ended up with, um, we ended up with 80. What do we have? 80, 80 ish ideas, 82 ideas, um, which is which is a lot to work with. But if you, uh, we'll try to, you know, if we could just keep scrolling up and down for those people that aren't sitting at the laptop at the table, just so they can see them. What we want to do, just take a couple of minutes and discuss at the table. We're going to go, just go through. We, it, it, there, there's no, you know, this was a brainstorming, right? We want to capture as many good ideas as, ideas as possible. But we also wanted to end up with. Uh, a small prioritized number that this group felt most strongly about putting resources and action and plans around immediately. And so um, it's a little daunting, but if we could do this, I think as a group, let's take let's take the 80 ideas, similar exercise, drag and drop into the buckets of brilliant, okay, not quite there yet. You know, needs needs more thought processes. So if we take the next few minutes. Um, again, for those that can't see the laptops on the screen, I apologize. We'll keep scrolling up and down. Call it out to your facilitator at the table, and let's just drag and drop the ideas into these three buckets of uh, brilliant, okay, and not quite there yet. Yeah. What about things that are like? We'll build it. We'll do next. Sorry. So, uh, sorry. Question here around. Uh, don't don't worry about feasibility yet. Right, so if it's a fantastic idea, but you can't imagine how it's done, let's save that. Let's still focus on it because maybe someone else has the answer. <laughs> so I think you should really start early. We're really harassed and start with middle school and high school. Yeah. And You've already gone through a lifetime of it. Right. Yes. Get to throw that in. If we need, we can add a new one. Um, uh, Steve, can we add a new one? The, the, there's a new one. How do we want to characterize it? Er, uh, early engage, early anti-harassment engagement. So, add a new. Sorry. Oh, they can type in now. Yeah, sorry. So you not add. So Sharon, would you mind? You can add a new one for early, early, early anti-harassment engagement. Yeah. Yes, definitely. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. 
or, or yeah, uh, it's probably natural at the end, where, or whenever you'd like. That's right, a quick, just quick announcement. Just a quick announcement. Uh, tomorrow, Wednesday, um, we have a Women in Blockchain meetup. And it's a monthly occurrence, um, different topics every time. And tomorrow we talk about circular economy. And it will happen uh, starting at 6.30, probably a little socializing first. And then um, at 7 p.m. the speakers go on. And it's at Microsoft. And it's uh, 11 Times Square. The entrance is on 42nd Street and 8th Avenue. So if you just come by, um, that might be a little risky, but um, if you go online today and you go to the uh, meetup page, uh, Women in Blockchain, and look for the New York City group, then you can sign up. That would be great. Absolutely. Great thank you. Great, thank you. All right, so, okay. We, 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 um, we, have a, we have a tough job to narrow it down to three. We've got 70 brilliant ideas, which I think is fantastic. Um, so uh, so um, do we even dare with the, it, or we could break the 70 down? We can group them? Yeah. Grouping, so let's, all right, let's see, let's see if we can call out some of the dupes quickly. Uh, which I can't do unless we scroll. So Steve, the, the, the I tell you, you know what? Honestly, let, let's let. I think it'll be fine. So let's do. Let's do. Let's have everyone work the list of seventy. Hopefully, at your table and in the discussions, you've got your favorites. And what we're going to do is um, is it, it's a little unwieldy with this number, but let's turn on a ranking. We're just going to try to get a vote from the room um, on the on the top ones that we might want to focus on in a group. No, twenty five is the max so we could do. All right, so let's so let's take let's re let's recharacterize them. So we're gonna we're gonna create we're gonna take all seventy of the brilliant bucket ones. Nope, oh, sixty eight now, uh, and put them. We're gonna do it again. So basically, we need to prioritize the list of seventy uh, down uh, smaller. So uh, uh, we're just gonna configure that really quickly, and then we'll do the same exercise. Drag it into a to three buckets of brilliant. You know, one one two three whatever uh, whatever we're typing in the moment. High, medium, low. Yeah, we get it down to 25. I'm sorry. Give us uh, one more minute. All right. So you, we have now. Sorry, you pulled them out of what? Sorry. Sorry. So this is really good news that essentially we uh, there's so many good ideas that we're breaking the tool, which is good. <laughs> it's a good sign. Um, so what we're gonna what I think uh, what I think is about to happen is we're gonna move all of the 71 into uh, uh, are we moving them? We're gonna move them into almost brilliant. If we then work that list down and pick one per table. So if just from the group, if you could just pick. The just it is not that we're not going to focus on more of them, but if you could pick your just absolute favorite 
table by table, and let's get the, that, that grouping into brilliant. That's roughly 20 tables. Yeah, roughly 20. All right, so talk at your table, look, look through the almost brilliant bucket, pick your absolute favorite, and let's narrow the list down. We have about half the tables. Raise your hand if you're still talking your table. Still trying to pick the one. All right, a few more. Everyone else, uh, one more over here. Anyone still working? Any tables still working? Two tables, all right. Uh, would you mind just scroll? Can you scroll down just so that people can see more of the list if they're not around the machine? 15. All right, take 30 more seconds. The, the two tables back here done. Done. So everyone got their, their one from the table? Good. All right. All right, six. Let's go with the 16 we have. Uh, all right, so now, so thank you very much for narrowing it down. Like I said, we're not losing any of this, and it doesn't mean that we won't focus on. Uh, uh, any other pieces, but we did want to come away with something very actionable. So we're going to take the, we're going to take this. Can you just click on the list of 16, please? Just make sure we don't have any dupes. All right. So, so sp um, sponsorships. Can we get, can we get three or four more words for that in terms of sponsorships? At what, what, at what meaning? What level? Is this? Um, which table picks sponsorships as their one? Okay, can you, um, uh, can you, Steve, can you open it up? Can you just type in, just finish the, a longer sentence, just something to um, more fully describe what it is that you want that one to be? Tax incentives to hire women, okay, that one's good. Women investors, gender anonymous identity, global, this is where actually, as parents of programs, white label, baseline salary report, Full paid maternity leave, encouragement to take family leave, no com no not conference don't support conferences that objectify women. If we scroll down, just want to read the full list. Senior support within the company, focus on skills and gender, require product roles on hackathon teams, diversity metrics, program to give skills for new moms. Okay. So, sorry, uh, the, so, all right, please scroll back to the top. Sorry, it's Jan, Jan. Sure. Um, Steve, can you, can you open it back up to add one? Uh, Jan, uh, can we get the microphone for Janet? 
Uh, did you guys come up with a slightly expanded? Uh, Sorry, the table there? table in the corner. Actually, did you um, did, were you able to come up with a slightly expanded oh. notion of sponsorships? You're working on it, okay. Um it's definitely an option. Yeah. Okay. Um at the risk of um at the risk of crashing the uh, the wireless no, we're good. Wire there's enough wireless in the room. As another option, if you want to start to participate directly, you can log into Think Tank on your phone, and when we do the voting, you can actually each vote individually. Um, that would require us putting the login instructions back up, which I'm uh, looking like that's going to be difficult. <laughs> yeah, I could say it. It's uh, so if if is anyone is, if anyone's interested in logging in on their phone to play along and be able to vote directly, uh, yes, show of hands, anyone? It's up. Um, take a second. You go to Accenture.thinktank.net, session ID three ninety seven, pass key BC one two three. All right, so in the interest of time, I know we're all going to have to start moving here in a second. Um, Steve, let's go back, and let's just then do a quick voting exercise on the 16, and then I definitely want to get to the, to the volunteer part of this. So can we, switch back, can we switch the views back to... All right, forget mobile. Let's th um, can we switch back to the uh, vote? And then let's go into... Oh, it's in rank now. All right, so at your, at your tables, this is now a drag-and-drop ranking. Can I get everyone's attention? So what we want to do is do a dra it's drag and drop. So at your table, work your list and drag the individual items up, you know, up and put them in rank order from 1 to 16. When you're finished putting them in the order that you, that you, that you want them to be in, then hit the vote, the vote button in the lower right-hand corner, the green vote button. So work with your facilitator at the table. Um, this view is our administrator view. We'll try to keep scrolling between them and put them in rank order. We're aiming here to, to get a to get to narrow it down to a top three. If you hit abstain, we have zero votes. Zero votes. All right, so we're gonna run out of time. So if you can. Top five. All right, so really, yeah, so really just focus on the top five. Don't worry about the rankings of the rest. Identify your top five and drag them to the top of the list. That's a, don't, worry, don't worry about the order of, of everything else there. Remember, this is, the entire bucket was brilliant. <laughs> so we're going to. Once you're comfortable with your top five, hit vote, please. Two votes. Five votes, all right. Almost there.
Six. If uh, if your table is voted, can I see your hand? Have raised show of hands. If your table voted, six of you voted. All right, we got one. Finish. Oh, it, it, sorry. You need to hit the green vote button in order to, for us to move on. So if you've finished your ordering, only worry about the top five. Don't worry about putting the rest of them in any exact order. All right, we're up to eight. All right, at some point we're just going to need to cut it off because I don't want to miss the last step. Sorry? At least if they do what we did, we didn't realize that it was a All right, nine, 13. We're looking for 13. All right, a few more. Almost done. I'm seeing some tables turning quiet. Some still. All right, I want to. All right, let's let's just uh, 12. All right, let's 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 um. We don't have to cut off. The, we don't have to cut off the voting. Can we show the? Can we go to the results? I think you're going to have to hit abstain, right? All right, so vote, vote distribution. So, all right, so let's, let's just take a look at the results here for a second. So, um, I didn't give you enough time to explain sponsorships. It can, uh, does, does anyone want to, can you, are you guys ready to elaborate on sponsorships uh, a little bit more? Got it. Okay. All right. Makes perfect sense. So sponsorships, uh, sponsorships was focused on the the highest level senior senior management sponsorship within our organizations. Then obviously then trans, uh, you know, uh, transferring to the roles that we play and the voices that you hear at conferences, which I think makes perfect sense. Uh, gender anonymous identity built on blockchain. I think we can get some really creative things there. Uh, tax incentives to hire women. I think it's great. So, um, what, so what we're going to do? What we want to do with this list? And again, just in the in the spirit of running out of time, let's quickly grab the top five. And um, this is the only part of this then that's going to turn not anonymous because we want to engage. So as, as Elisa said, we're going to be opening up our we're going to be opening up our our, our our subpage of our website dedicated to driving this forward, and it's a place where you can come and collaborate. So anything else? You want, what else should we share about it? It will be in a second. It, it's on now. Good. Um, it, it will actually be. It will, you'll be able to link to it from our Accenture.com forward slash blockchain. It will actually be housed in a different section on on its own cloud, so we can engage in a private forum. Um, it will require you to register. Um, we want to obviously know who's engaging, but it will be a forum for us to be able to have a conversation ongoing from this point forward. So, so to that, just to kick to kickstart the engagement with these top five ideas, um, uh, and again, this is the only part of this that won't be anonymous. If you're comfortable and you're interested and you want to click on one of the five and put in your email address, that'll be the easiest way to, for just to, us to fir make first contact around getting structure around this group and, and collaborating. So um, just quickly as a table, and sorry, it, it, actually, before we finish this, I just want a huge thank you to the facilitators. Most of you did not know you were going to be facilitators before you got in the room. And I just, <laughs> I, 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 I could not be more appreciative of the fact that you guys stepped up and, and just did this uh, just on, on the fly. So thank you so much. Um, so click on so click on individual ones, uh, items, uh, and, uh, and, pro and provide your email address. Uh, that will then be part of essentially the meeting minutes from this session uh, that will be available, and it will be a mechanism by us, for us to engage with you. But as Elisa said, there'll be the means for you to reach out to us uh, when when the uh, site gets launched. So with that, I just want to thank everybody uh, for this. Uh, this uh, this is a, a critically important dialogue. We've got to get this right. I, I hope that this was valuable and uh, really appreciate everyone's time. We really look forward to engaging and, uh, and driving this forward together. And again, huge thanks to the panel yesterday. 
you know, I, I, Alisa and Caitlin and Sharon and Amber and uh, Galia and Hannah and Christine. I did that right that time. Yeah. Um, just, you know, aw awesome job yesterday. I was so impressed and moved. So thank you, everyone, and look forward to continuing this throughout the conference.